For more videos on people's struggles, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Hundreds of students took to the streets of France in solidarity with Anas Gay, a 22-year-old student at Lyon University who attempted suicide on Friday, November the 8th. Anas set himself alight outside the building that houses the Regional Student Aid Center in the city of Lyon. According to medical authorities, Anas was hospitalized with severe burns and his condition remains critical. Vendredi après-midi, qu'un de nos camarades a tenté de se suicider en simulant par le feu, voulant ainsi dénoncer la précarité dont il était victime, au même titre qu'un trop grand nombre d'étudiants et d'étudiantes. His suicide attempt was reported to be because of his dire financial situation. Students in France organized protests against the precarious living conditions in the country and to express solidarity with Anas. Breaking into the premises of an amphitheater in Lille, they forced the cancellation of a conference by former president Francois Hollande. Parallel protests were organized in Lyon, Bordeaux, Toulouse, Montpellier and Nantes. Members of Communist Youth Organization, MGCF, and Communist Students Organization, UEC, along with members of the Student Union Solidare, of which Anas was a member, also took part in the protest. Before attempting suicide, Anas had written on Facebook detailing his financial difficulties and called the Student Aid Center at Lyon a political target that represented the interests of Higher Education Ministry and the Government of France. The post read, I'm doing the second year of my bachelor's degree for the third time. I have no grant. Even when I had one, I got only 450 euros per month. How can one live on that? Pour, euh, pour dire notre ras-le-bol de cette précarité étudiante euh, qui, qui, qui broie les étudiants. C'est ce qu'il a voulu mettre en avant dans sa tentative de suicide et que ça serve à quelque chose, à mettre la précarité étudiante et ses combats politiques au centre de l'actualité. Mais c'est quand même effrayant qu'il en soit arrivé à se dire que ça pouvait être le seul moyen. He blamed the incumbent president Emmanuel Macron, his two predecessors Hollande and Nicolas Sarkozy, and the European Union for having pushed him into poverty. He also accused right-wing politician Marie Le Pen and the French media for contributing to this. His pose ends by asking students to hit the streets to bring about a change to the situation faced by thousands of them across France. Yeah,